right, let's look at this bad boy, huh? First impressions, though, the siding's not bad. It's just really overgrown. Yeah, let's go and check this thing out. This leaf is the size of my head. <laughs> What's that? This leaf is the size nice. of my head. It's a real elephant ear. All right, so this house, the, the situation is that our team put it under contract as a wholesale, and they want us to come buy it. They think that if we add, if we can finish off the attic, it'll add enough square footage to give it a lot more value. Yeah, and I love doing that. We've done that to a ton of houses, adding yeah. extra square footage to, to a house. If there's already an attic and you've already got roof space and all you have to do is insulate it and put some carpet and add a closet, you know, yeah. an electrical, that's a great thing to do. Totally, I'm excited about that. But let's take a look at the outside. Right now, I see the outside, decent shape, you know, side and that kind of stuff. But the siding gonna, actually looks really good. It does. And before we spend too much time on the house, though, we're gonna have to, hey, what is this over here? Oh, God, are there are there uh, oh, solar panels? Yeah, the whole, the oh, whole roof up here is covered in solar panels. Why didn't they take off that ugly, I mean, it's obviously new siding. Why didn't they take off that oh, yeah, the entire, ugly metal the entire porch roof, roof when they resided? Now when you take that off, okay. there's holes well, in the siding. So that out of the gates, that's not good for resale value at all. Yeah. Is the other side all covered too? This side's all covered. Oh, it is? Yeah. The other, the other side's all covered. So the roof's covered, in, yeah. Okay. The, the trouble with solar panels right out of the gates is that most people that have solar panels are under 20 or 40 year contracts for those. And most people, although it's a great idea to have on your house, a lot of people will not buy a house if that's on there because they just don't want to be locked into a 40 year commitment. Even though it's transferable, they're not thrilled with the idea. We've had problems with that in the, in the past, maybe other areas of the country, people are more used to it, but here in the Northeast, they're not thrilled about it. So that's kind of a, yeah, almost that's a, a negative out of the gates. Yeah. All right. Well, but, Let's see the attic, because that's what we really came to see, yeah. is, does the attic work? So let's go see if Let, that let's works. Let's see if there's something so fantastic about the house that somebody could overlook that. Right, let's go inside. <laughs> All right, let me... Uh... So I have to talk about my partner here. He's always so nice when we go in a house. Instead of letting me go in first, he goes in first, but it's to protect me. I take the bullets, <laughs> just in case. Uh, let's see, so hmm. lots of stuff here. Wow, look, yeah. at this. look at this, look at this. Hey, you want a drink? Wow. There's some There's scotch whiskey of, here. There's a lot of stuff. Oh my goodness, hey, okay. It's, it's almost the holidays. There's some nice. bailies. All right, good. So obviously a lot of stuff in the house. You have to be able to look past all that, but yeah. let's uh, let's look over here. Hey, what's this? Oh. All right, just checking. So Jeez. what that is, I just, ah, just saw it there. All right, so. Let me jump out of my skin. So as I look around, uh, it needs updating throughout the rest of the house as well. Yeah, it's a little outdated. Toilet is off. Do not use unless you turn water on and then off. All right. So I tell you what, I think we're already kind of knowing this may not be a good working What's situation. What's this over here? No, like a library. Yeah. Okay. Like a little library, den, office. Okay. No closet, so it can't Ooh, be a bedroom sorry. and it's small. Definitely small. All right, well, we've seen down here, I think we know what we're, what we're working with. Before we even look at the basement or anything else, let's go upstairs to see if that attic will even work. Yeah. If that doesn't work, then this is gonna be a no-go all the way, right? Sounds good. All right, let's go up there. So look at this for your Christmas tree. These are 12 gauge shotgun shells that have lights in them. Oh, that's kind of funny. Might buy the house just for those, they're pretty cool. All right. All right, let's... Ah, that Duke is a hazard. Oh, Bo and my Luke. My childhood crush. Bo and Luke Duke. Look at that bad boy. Oh my goodness. What was that thing called? What was that car called? The, um... Ah, the Rebel, the something. Ah, I forgot what it was. I'm sure you viewers will know what it is. Sorry. Oh my goodness, that's going to drive me crazy now. Oh. Uh, yeah, uh, I can't even stand up here. This is no headroom to get up here. Yeah, you'd have to raise this whole roof up that's to a even whole, get up that's here. That's a lot of money. Yes, it is. You know, anything can be done with money. It just makes sense. Does, does it make so sense? So the good news is that we have Ooh. the length of the house. Yeah, the bad but... news is I can touch this. So this is about six feet tall, maybe. So we don't have headroom up here. This whole roof would have know, to be raised. I don't even know how we've done plenty of these, but you've got to have, I think in this town, you've got to have this, 
Is it seven foot I four? Say, uh, seven something. Seven um, yeah. six, seven four. We we stepped down about three inches, but I still can touch. So yeah. Yeah, I mean I'm that won't know, work. I'm all a five eight, and this is not. Look at this. Oh, nothing. I thought it was something. No, else. it's just paper. So it, if you want to finish it off an attic, you've got to have at least in this in this town to the center. Once the sheetrock is in, yeah. I think it's seven foot four or seven foot six. That's got to be it. Even though, even if the the pitch goes down, as long as the center is right. high enough, correct. And you do this, you can have what's called knee walls on the side. You can finish these off. I gotta tell you, I don't see this happening. It's right? unfortunate that this doesn't have another foot and a half because what a great space this would be. But it's yeah. just, it's not the numbers wouldn't work to raise let, this whole roof. Let's and, go back down and just talk numbers, just in general, just to kind of talk about this house and and let people know yeah. what we're thinking, so they can see why why we're gonna. Well, yeah. let's make our decision downstairs. The General Lee. The General Lee, that was it. The General Lee, that's the name of the car. All right. And Daisy Duke. Well, I think I knew about Daisy Duke. Yes, I'm sure you did. <laughs> I'm not sure how long he's going to... I'm not sure how long he's going to live on this retirement fund. It's not to... So, our decision in this house, the attic is a no-go. The, you know, the mess the mess doesn't bother us, right? Yeah. The mess doesn't bother us, but... Our team, our team said that he owes $110,000 in the house. So the minimum we could pay, he has no money to bring to the table. It's okay to sometimes ask sellers to bring money to the table if they owe more than it's worth. So we've done that many times, but in this case, I don't think he has any money to bring to the table. So we'd have to pay $110,000 to buy the house. The resale, the ARV or after repair value here, I don't think we're any more than 160. Yeah, it's even like, even with the square footage, I don't think it's one maybe three bedroom, one bath. It's a busy road right yeah. next to us. There's just no room in this deal for no. us. I think there's no room in the deal. And, and even if we could finish the attic, I don't think it sells for much more than 200. Right. So even then, there's still no room in the. Because the cost, yeah, out, the no. cost doesn't justify it. Yeah. No. So I think this is going to be a pass. Yep. And guys, sometimes saying no is the best thing you can do to an investment because saying no is sometimes the best thing you can. <laughs> that hurt <laughs> woman so don't get mad just get even <laughs> she's so cute all right so sometimes say, sometimes saying no is okay to walk away from a deal best thing you can do so we're gonna pass on this one we'll see you in the next episode